Hey guys, welcome back to part four of my getting started with HTML5 series. Um, if you've been following the videos, I kind of messed up on the numbering scheme. Um, the first video was 1.0, the second was saving a document, it was 1.0.1. The third was opening files, which was 1.0.3. So I kind of messed up. I kind of messed up on the name of that. It should have been 1.0.2. So the numbers are correct in the titles, but in the video I mispronounced what the title should be. But anyways, to this video, this will be 1.0.3. Um, now we're continuing with our web page. Web page here. We haven't really started coding anything yet, but now we're going to start. And we're going to add a title to our web page. So to add a title to the web page, you obviously open up your document. And we're going to do this in the head section of the document. So now we can, uh, we'll see a tab didn't really work. So we're going to space it up a little bit. So one, two, three, that lines it up here. And we'll do one, two, three, just to keep it nice and easy. Um, so Basically, what a title does to the web page is when you open up a web page and it has um, your tab, or at the very top of the thing, it will say what the title of the web page is. So, for example, we're going to say title and then the title. And then, of course, we always want to end it with the slash. So, remember that. And then, there you go, guys. So now basically what's happening here is you have your document, it's an HTML document, and in the header section of your document, you're gonna have a title, which is the title, and then we're ending the title. And then it ends the head, and then we obviously don't have anything for body yet, it ends body, and then it ends your HTML file. That is what is happening when you are gonna go to your web browser and the, that's how the web browser is gonna read it. So before you open this up and check it, um, Command S or Save or Control S if you're on Windows, save it, go into where you're saved and then open it up. And now you, you can tell there's nothing here, but just like I said, the title appears in the tab bar or at the very top of the window. Now we're gonna go ahead and check the page source here. So page, show page source. And as you can tell, this is our document, guys. We have coded this, and now it is appearing in the web browser, and it is re reading it correctly. So for the next part of the video, I'm going to actually start um, showing you guys how to add comments. And comments don't actually show up on the web page itself. It's kind of like background information if you want to say, like, well, this is a comment about who made the website or uh, more advanced stuff, which I'll show you guys later. But stay tuned for that, guys, and I hope you enjoyed this part. Quick little section, and I'll see you in the next part.